So we're going to make meloxicam capsules right now, and uh, all that's required is that we take our pre-measured meloxicam powder, and we're just going to take <coughs> any grit out of it. Not much grit in this. And the reason why I just threw that all in like that is that we're going to put it into instead of geometric dilution. We are going to pour it into this little mixer. So this is the Inversina. In about a minute, you can watch, if you get close into this, you can tell that it kind of rotates and it spins back and forth. So we're gonna do that for about a minute. I'll slow it down so you can see what's happening in there. I'm gonna do that for about a minute. So we ground up the grit with mortar and pestle, and we uh, mix this up. The final strength is going to be seven and a half milligrams. Pop that out. I'll put that away. We're going to take our number three size capsule. Put down the base plate. You can look in close here. And we'll put down plate A. Plate B, and would you believe plate C? Put the top plate on. And typically it would be all gloved and gown here, but I'm just giving you a, a sense of what it's like to mix these. Just put these all. What this will do is it'll give us 50 aligned into. these rows and then I will do it again except we're going to be doing 90 capsules which means the very top row we're going to leave empty so I'll just fill up that top row and get the rest in the bottom row There we go. Perfect. Now I'm going to use these guide holes at the top, drop them down again. So what that's done is it's put the, all of the heads of the capsule up and all the tails of the capsule down. Goes away. I'm going to put this top down, lock the bottoms and pull the tops off. We have the tops there and we have the bottoms here, if we can look down here. I'm gonna drop them down and I'm gonna cover with just a piece of masking tape the top, because we don't want any powder getting in there. Okay, so we can now begin to fill. take my powder that we have just mixed up and going right to the corners we're going to fill all of these capsules. So the filler is the bulk of what you see here. And it's just an inert powder that allows us to more accurately dilute the active ingredient in here. So what this is a tamp, the tamper will push down all the powder. 
we'll do it again. Keep doing that until we have all the powder in there. So take a few times to get that all in there. our last little tamping down of the powder and we're left now with full capsules, full tails. I will take the tops, push the bottoms into them. Now I'm going to pick them up. We've got all of the tails and the heads combined. I'll just lock all the bottoms and tops together. And then when I open them, I can fall into here. Good. So now, if I take just a little bit of uh, salt or sodium chloride, scatter it in there, just shake it up a bit, I'll take the moisture and any powder off. Now we're going to go over to the sink and just shake that out. capsules ready to go seven and a half milligram the reason why we're making these uh, is that uh, even though seven and a half is commercially available they want it with no uh, of, nothing to do with the filler that's in there now because they're having a reaction to it that's how you make capsules and uh, thanks Adam for filming this for us